When it comes to people's views of what success looks like, most people fall into two main categories, what I call the materialists and the visionaries. The materialist motto is money buys happiness. They are consumed by the amount of money they think they need in their lives and overjoyed at the prospect of attaining more things. The latest iPhone, designer clothing, big house, luxury car, the list goes on. They believe the more of these things they possess, the more joy it will bring to their lives. If I was to tell a materialist that I wanted to pursue a career in the arts, they would ask me, how are you going to make money with that? A visionary, on the other hand, would ask, is that what makes you happy? Visionaries follow another road to success, and it's not dependent on money. It requires you to know what it is you're passionate about, what lights a fire inside of you. For me, this is music. Music means a lot of things for a lot of people. A single composition can be interpreted a thousand different ways. Playing the piano is an opportunity for me to communicate myself expressively. When I'm playing a beautiful piece, I forget everything else that's going on in the world around me and develop a deep personal connection with the music. Performing allows me to share my artistic perspective with the world, bring these pieces to life, and paint vivid pictures in the audience's minds. I love to write my own music too, and to me, composing is simply beyond writing notes and rhythms. It unlocks a world of possibilities for me to arouse the listener's emotions, stimulate their thoughts, and discover the power of musical self-expression. A visionary whom I admire very much is YouTuber Drew Alexander Ford, AKA that viola kid. A classical violist of color, he was told he couldn't make money as a musician. Since graduating from Juilliard, he's created his own path as a violist slash rapper, redefining today's image of a successful classical musician. Through his social media campaign, hashtag play homie play, TVK motivates young artists to pursue their musical ambitions. Everyone knows JK Rowling, world famous author of the Harry Potter series. But did you know that she was living off government assistance when she started writing her books? She didn't let the fact that she was struggling through poverty hold her back from embracing her passion. She is a visionary. Many companies, such as McDonald's, Zara, and Mary Kay Cosmetics, would not exist today if their founders didn't have the courage to aspire to their happiness. They all reached a critical moment in their lives where they realized they could do so much more if they followed their dreams. These influential people are the ones who believe in their hearts. They find success in doing what they love. I want to be one of these people who loves what they do every day. In my future, I see myself combining my love for music with my passion for writing. I could easily envision a career as a composer, a critic for the classical review, a program annotator for a major symphony orchestra, or all of the above. However, my family comes from backgrounds in business and science, and they have challenged my ideas. They want to be sure that I'll be able to sustain myself in the future. Believe it or not, this is why so many people are afraid of going for whatever brings joy to their lives. They are scared of not making enough money, not having a stable profession, or that their extraordinary career choice doesn't fit with society's standards of what is successful. Sadly, people like this end up compa comparing their careers and their own ideas of success with others. But a lot of them don't understand that success is a highly individualized concept. We tend to immediately equate success with making it big, without realizing that success is truly relative and has a unique definition for each person. Most of us have been conditioned to follow a formula for success in life. College, grad school, job, work my way up the ladder, retirement. Although success is often sequential, there is no defined formula. Success doesn't even have to be related to one's career path at all. One can simply live life fulfilled by happiness and they have reached success.
Happiness is truly the road less traveled. I challenge you to be bold and take this road. If you go after what makes your heart happy, then I promise you are ultimately bound for success. The journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. Make each step count. Thank you.